your last move, please. What? <laughs> no. You the fuckery. This game is on some fuckery. The fuck, man. God. Hey, guys. Welcome back to the third episode of my Pokemon Radical Red Hardcore Mode Adventure. So, in the last episode, we beat Brandon the second time after he destroyed us the first time. And then our journey was cut short by some random bug bitch at the end of Viridian Forest. <laughs> so in this episode, we're going to start by going back to beat Bug Boy Sammy. And then hopefully we're going to make our way up to Peter City where we will beat Brock in this episode. Hopefully. I'm not sure because this game is on some shit. <laughs> you never know what you're going to encounter. So without further ado, let's get started. So I'm gonna run back up here. Run back to Bug Boy Sammy. By the way, how are you guys doing? Hope you're having a wonderful day. Hope you're having a wonderful day. I know it's, I know the world right now is very tumultuous, but you have to keep the faith, have to keep your hope up. Make no use giving in to despair. So, I'm not sure who I'm going to use first against him. Definitely not my Tiana. <laughs> this Cricket Tune just took me by surprise, man. It just killed my Tiana. Well, it killed my Marrow. I didn't expect it to have um, Bullet Seed. Because, again, I wasn't taking him seriously. I thought it was just going to be... A, uh, a random battle because all the battles before before that were easy like level 6 and all of a sudden they threw in this level 14 guy well level 15 with level 15 Pokemon and they hit pretty hard so <laughs> I was caught off guard not this time though not this time not this time bug boy Sammy <laughs> let me see I'm gonna pick first against Krikatoon it knows. Uh, can't use him. Can't use him. Super is probably going to be useless too. It doesn't know any flying moves. Mm. I may lose again. Because I don't have anything that can really hit them hard. I'm going to try though. If I fail this time again, I'm going to catch a spear and use that. All right, Bug Boy Sammy. Again, I like my team, so I'm going to use the same team. If I, I run into problems, I'm just going to change. I will add one more Pokemon. Uh, let's see. They have nothing. All I have is just Roo Roo. So let's go. Come on, Bug Boy Sammy. Your ass is going down this time. Not going to lose to you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Growl. Ouch. Sludge. I wish I was not going to be faster than this other Pokemon, so. Ooh, he lived. That's okay. Aqua Jet. Who's it gonna use now? What you got for me this time, boy? Oh, very nice. 
Volbeat. Huh, let me think. There's a reason why he sent out Volbeat and not Dustox. So. Uh, let me think here. He's probably going to use... I have no choice but to keep Marilyn in. I'll use Covet. What? Why, man? Oh, God. Flash lowers your attack. It knows Mega Drain. Really? What in the hell? <laughs> Go, my Tiana. I'm going to use Bite and then I'm going to use. Wait. Should I use Roar? Roar him out? Bring out Dust Ox? But Dust Ox is going to just. Use Bite. Why is it faster than me? Why is it faster than me? Sucker punch. Die, please. No. <laughs> no. No, man. God damn. Hopefully you're fast enough to beat him. Fairy Wind. Come on. If he falls asleep long enough, I should be able to send out um, Meditite. Go. And then I could Rock Tomb him. Please, please. Okay. Come on, you can do this. Please don't wake up. Please don't wake up right next one. Please, please stay asleep. No! Why? Stay a fuck asleep. God damn it. Fake out. It has block sludge. Really? Rock tomb. Nice. Your last move, please. What? <laughs> No, <laughs> you the fuckery. This game is on some fuckery. The fuck, man. God damn, I'm dead. <laughs> this game is. This game is. God damn, man. Of course, it has protect. Of course, it has protect. Sleep powder, man. And avoided the attack. <sighs> this is not a good way to start the episode. <laughs> oh, God. Of course, I have nothing against that. Fairy Wind. Ah. 
<sighs> All right, bug boy, you got me again. I lost again. Okay, I'm gonna definitely add Spiro to the team. Yeah, I'm gonna add Spiro. All right, so I'm gonna catch a Spiro, level it up, and then I'm gonna be back. So stay tuned. Hey guys, so I'm back again. And look, look this. Look what I got. Spiro. And guess what I named them? Rain. Because it's gonna rain on these hoes. <laughs> cringe, cringe. Stop the video. Stop the video. <laughs> Oh man, it sucks that I have to go through these lengths to beat a little bug boy on in on at the end of the route. But hey, Sammy is no joke, man. He's no joke at all. Probably when my channel gets a bit bigger, I'll probably make T-shirts and put him as a meme on it because he definitely deserves a spot as an obstacle in my journey because that boy is hard as hell. God damn, who would have thought? So I'm on my way to meet him. Hopefully this time I can beat him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I could. Last time I I, I would have won if I had probably not used Fake Out. If I just used like Rock Tube, I think I would have killed his um Volbeat a lot quicker. Hey, it happens. So bug boy Sammy, third battle. I mean, it sucks that I started the, the game, well, the episode by losing to him, but hey, I am not going to remove my losses. I'm gonna show you everything. I think it's a part of the journey because you're not always gonna win in life or in video games. So here we go. Let's do this. Sucks that I have to beat him with six Pokemon, but <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, Bug Boy Sammy is a beast. Okay, it's a beast. I need all the help I can get. Let's go. Here we go for the win. Go, Rain. How is he faster than me? Why? Oh my god! Oh my goodness, the fuck? The fuck? No. This game is fucked up. How the fuck is Cricket Toon faster than me? Why? And why does he have Rock Toon? They don't start with the fuck you already. Fuck, man. <laughs> what the fuck? This is not fair. Use Growl. <sighs> no, I don't want to lose again. No, this is not fair. Stay the fuck asleep this time. Stay the fuck asleep. All right. Throw my Tiana. Don't wake up. Stay asleep. Uh huh. Uh huh. Fight it. Nice. Oh, one down, one to go. Two more to go. <laughs> Jesus Lord, this fucking game, what am I gonna do now? He's gonna lower my attack. Gonna use a bug move, what do I do? Put him to sleep again. Hey, that's what you gotta do. Right. 
to go hit, of course. Game, go Marrow. Hey Marrow, <laughs> I can't even think straight. Go use Rock Team. I should survive that. One more hit. One more hit. Shouldn't be faster than me. Shouldn't be faster than me. Kill it. Please. Please die. Just die. No. <laughs> the fuckery. The fuckery. The fuckery. No. Live. Oh. Confusion. Use confusion. Thank you, Lord Jesus. <laughs> Thank you, Lord Jesus. Let's die. Out of there, man. Out of there. One more. What should I use? Rock Tomb. Oh, you fucked up now. Or is he gonna use Protect? He's gonna use Protect, isn't he? The bitch. Protect. Oh, you didn't use protect. Nice. What in the actual fuck? It knows roost. It knows roost. Why? Why do you know roost? What is wrong with these people? Why did you give it roost? No. I am sick of these people bite the fuck up to death. Yes. You are going to die this time. Even if you use protect, I am still stronger than you. Die. Does not matter. Die. Die, I don't care. I'll keep spamming bite. Bite the fuck out of this bitch. I mean shit, bite. Yes. Yes, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, the fuck. The fuck. Finally beat this little kid. This little piece of shit. Fuck you, Buck Catcher Sammy. Fuck you. Oh my god. I can finally move on. Oh, I'm sweating. My hands are sweating. <laughs> my hands are sweating. Oh my god, I almost lost Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, Jesus Lord. I did it. Let me save this shit. Let me move on from this. No. No. It's a nightmare. What you gotta say to me? You can find stuff on the ground. Fuck you. No, I'm not helping you. Fuck away from me. Fuck away from me. Finally, I'm moving on to Peter City. Finally. <gasps> All right, let me calm down. <laughs> let me calm down. Okay, let me calm down. Oh, Lord Jesus. That was just... Yes, I know that evolution cancel technique. Ooh. Ooh. Peter City. I'm here. What's up? Ooh. What's this? What? I can go here already? Oh. Wow, I have no Pokemon to enter here with, though. Like. Nothing fast enough? Oh, yes, I do have my TNN now. What am I talking about? Again, I can't even think straight. <laughs> I 
I can't even think straight. What the fuck, man? Ah, it's finally I'm in Pewter City. Good lord. Let's probably go and challenge Brock right away. Let's get this over with. What this guy over here gonna say? Time for that. I got the time, my girl. I got the time. We hit a, we're on a serious mission. We're gonna beat Brock's ass. Oh, check out other ROM hacks that utilize the CFR engine. Unbound Dreams and GS Chronicles. Oh, okay. So they got other games. Nice. I'll probably definitely check those out. As I'm liking this game so far, the difficulty is. It's up there. <laughs> it's up there. Stop pushing my huge power. My huge power on my slack. What? Okay. I don't know what that is. It's nice to know. Uh, no, I don't know. Oh, give me some now. I get some repels. Yes. You're not gonna give me any, you cheap bastard. <laughs> What's up here? Not yet. Yep. What's over here? Nothing. Nothing over here. Who are you? You challenge the gym immediately or you have to go somewhere? Oh. Okay, you don't want me to go to the museum. Let's go there and see what's up. Hey, old man. No, sir, I don't got the money for that. 5,000 for an egg. What's even in the egg? Okay. Alright, so I've talked to everybody. I think, yeah. What's over here? Nothing special. Let's go to the gym. Let's go to the museum and see. Have in store for me here. Let me save just in case I've got to some kind of shit. You never know. <laughs> this game literally has me paranoid. Like I'm, I'm nervous about every little, every little nook and cranny. You never know what you're gonna come across. You might come across a little shithead kid. <laughs> Kick your ass <laughs> three times. Well, nearly three times. Oh, who's this? This person looks important. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, bitch. <laughs> He's colorful. You know, when you meet colorful people in Pokemon, there's someone important. He's purple or blue, whatever it is. Volkner. Oh God. Oh God. Bird Pokemon. Oh God. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's see what you got. Bird Pokemon, huh? How many does he have? Five Pokemon. Lord Father in heaven. <laughs> Trumbeak. Rain. 
Rain on this hoe. Come on. Use growl. Hmm. Shouldn't hit too hard. Right, his speed will rise, but. Aerial Ace. But he has no, no flying moves. That's all he knows. Apparently. It's not going to do shit, man. What? Of course it's a fucking critical hit. Of fucking course. Uh, Maro. Luckily, I know Aqua Jets. <laughs> what that was. Oh, Bullet Seed. Stop. 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 What? Stop. Stop. Please stop. Of course they make him do it five times. Of course. Is it no skill link? Probably. What does he have? Emolga. U-turn. Sludge. Okay, I have nothing to bring out against them. Let him die. Sorry. Sorry, Ruvu. Hidden power. Hmm. My Tiana. Sucker punch. You shouldn't have anything against me. He will shock wave you. That shouldn't do too much. Alright, sucker punch. Out of there. Fucking there, man. God damn. I'm waiting for the fuckery. <laughs> a Yanma. <laughs> a Yanma, okay. Why did he choose a Yanma? Oh, he wants to use a bug, a bug move on me. Nope. Fuck you. Slip open, of course. Oh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. I didn't know speed boost. <laughs> oh, God, this game is fucked up, man. I'm dead on time, yep. Yep. I have nothing against that. <sighs> I'm, I've lost again. Aqua Jet. Yep. Yep. I have nothing against that, man. Unless he gets a critical hit. Critical hit for me? Nope. Not to be. It's not meant to be. Fucking hell, man. Hey. 
And he has no priority moves, no speed ups, nothing. Take out. He's way too fast now. If he didn't get that boost, I'd probably still a chance against him. But that boost really fucked me over, man. RNG. RNG. <laughs> oh god, this game is so annoying. What do I do? Do I get an electric type? <laughs> do I go and get an electric type? Do I go and get an electric type? I don't think so. I think I'll probably just rearrange my team better. I'll try again this time with my team rearranged. Although I have two Pokemon that are, well, one, two, three Pokemon that are weak against his squad. That's not good. Huh. And Super has no, no flying moves. Come on, man. You have flying moves. see me think wait I think I can give them orange berries right so I got out orange berries where's the berries berry pouch I have five all right give each other an orange berry you get an orange berry and you get an orange berry <laughs> Should help me a lot, I think. Right? Never estimate ten HP. All right. If I fail this time, I'll probably go and... Hmm. I'm thinking, should I go and catch an electric type? Or should I just... Decisions, decisions. Should I go get an electric type or should I just battle him as it is? What do you guys think? What do you guys think I should do? Hmm. Trumpicus first. It knows bullet seed. It has flame charge, so it can protect itself from being walled by, so it can target grass types. Hmm. Oh, I'm thinking, I'm really thinking of what I should do, because I'm not sure. I have nothing against him, like, three of my Pokemon are weak against flying. I didn't expect to encounter a flying type trainer so early. I thought it would just be Brock, so I was catching Pokemon based, well, based on what I like and based on who would be good against Brock. So as you can see, I have grass, water, fighting, grass again. Might here not to hit hard just in case he has some fuckery. Rain because I just I want a, f a Fearer in my squad and because he's he was good against fucking OP ass bug catcher Sami. So now that I'm facing against a flying type, we need to capture a rock on electric type. Just at least one. Swap out rain for a flying or rain for an electric or rock. I think I may do that. Yeah, I think I'll do that and I'll be right back. All right, so hey guys, I'm back and look what I caught. So I caught a Alolan Geodude, named him Sparks. He has Jolly Nature. He has Rock Throw and Spark. I basically got him because he would be really good against uh, Faulkner's flying team. The next Pokemon I caught is Krikatoon. 
Now, I did some research and Cricket Tune has some really amazing stats in this game. So that's basically the reason why I have him on my team. Plus he learns Technician and he learns some pretty amazing skills. Fury Cutter for one and Rock Tomb. All these skills are boosted by a Technician. So he's a pretty powerful hitter. Definitely going to switch him out. Well, I'm definitely going to switch out Ivysaur for him. I'm not really a fan of Ivysaur. I don't know. I just, I never have been. <laughs> Basically, I picked Ivysaur because I thought he'd be he'd be uh, easy against Brock, and he would. I'm not really a fan of Ivysaur. So the next one I caught is Mister, which is my Alolan Diglett. Now, Mister is a ground steel type, which can be good against Brock if he doesn't have any fuckery in his team. <laughs> But he'll be really good against LT Surge later on. So he's definitely a keeper. He learns Tangling Hair. He has Jolly Nature, which increases his speed. And he learns some pretty cool skills, including Magnitude. So I'm pretty proud about this one. Other than that, I still have my Marrow, my Spearow, and my Mightyena. So, yeah. Some of you may, may be thinking this is not the most optimal team. But, hey, it's what I want to try. If things don't work out, then I will just probably capture a bunch of rock and electric types and you know try it that way. But for the most part, I just wanna I just wanna get over Faulkner and I wanna do it with a team that I like. You understand? Hopefully you do. <laughs> so here we go. We're gonna fight Faulkner. So the first one out is gonna be Sparks. Now Tucanon has grass moves and it looks like it has skill link so it'll probably hit my Geodude pretty hard yep so I'm thinking I'm gonna send Marilyn first no I'm gonna send Rain first to take him on right Rain might die because Tucanon is faster it has really high speed like 75 base move speed in this game, so. But I'm hoping things work out. Later on, I'll become more strategic with my teams. Because I'll have more access to more Pokemon. And more and a, and a, and a greater move pool. So, yeah. This is the journey for now. <laughs> Alright. Let's do this. Let's beat your ass. I love the music. Alright. Trumbeak. Oh, let me said. When I said to Cannon, I meant Trumbeak. <laughs> I was saying to Cannon the whole time. Trumbeak. Alright. I think I'll use Prowl. Yeah, it doesn't matter. We use Growl. Then I'll use Aerial Ace. No critical hits this time, please. No dumbass critical hits. Oh, nice. I forgot he had that on him. <laughs> no critical hits. Nice. Two more hits and he should be dead. One more hit. He does have a flying move. What the hell? So I never used it. <laughs> That's insane. Imago will be faster. What should I do? He's a flying type. I can send out my ground type to stop his his shockwave in this. What does he have to fight Emolga? He has rock throw. Hmm. 
here's what I'll go. Here's, here's what I'll do. Go. Here's what I'll do. Let me try something. Right. It does nothing. Return. He'll use that air move. I can resist it with him. Sparks. <gasps> what? 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 I mean, I knew he had hidden power, but it's super effective. What the fuck? Man, <laughs> I messed that up. Go, my Tiana. Bite. Nice. Very nice. Nice. Finally, I'm, I'm getting some RNG in my favor. Right. Fucking Yanma. He's gonna use a bug move. Pick a two and go. Don't resist stats this time, please. I don't care about that. Rock Tomb. What? What the fuck? Yes, Charlie Berry. Woo! That would have killed it, of course, because it's four times weak to rock. It's gonna use an air move. Go Marrow. He predicted that I would use a water Pokemon. That is some bullshit. That is some bullshit. Who would have thought? I should have probably sent out um, um, Mighty Anna. That's what I should have done. God damn, I'm not thinking. Sucker Punch. Right, finally I got past. <laughs> I got past this third Pokemon. Let me see what his last two are. Farfetched. Farfetched is a fighting type, right? I think it is a fighting type. It's slow, though. Oh. It's going to use a fighting move on me. I don't have anything that will take a hit from it. Hmm. The Yanmai is problematic though, that Yanmai is a problem. What do I do? I can keep in my Tiana and can hit him, but it'll hit him. It won't be super effective. I think in this game, it's a flying fighting. So bite will not really work. If I switch out and send out my Tiglet. I think I'll speed him with Rain and Cricketune. I could probably send out Cricketune. I have to let my Tiana go, it seems so. I can't risk weakening the others. Sorry. I can't risk it. Oh, I can use Roar. Hopefully I'm faster. Why are they always faster than me? Come on, man. 
Why is it faster? It's a fucking far-fetched. Come on, man. Come the fuck on. It's faster than my Tiana. Aerial Ace. It's faster than my Sparrow too. Really, man? I can't use Rock 2. Fairy Cutter. Why are these Pokemon faster than me? <sighs> Use Metal Claw. I'll use Rock Slash, yeah. <sighs> oh well. Lost again. <laughs> Man, I have to get over the fucking Yanma. I have to save a Pokemon I can fight Yanma effectively. I think I'll use the same team, but I'll just rearrange them a little bit better. Yeah. Anyway, I think this is where I'll end the video. <laughs> the video is now about over 30 minutes long. I don't want to make them too long, so I'll leave it here. And the next episode, I'll beat Faulkner definitely and hopefully challenge Brock. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Have a blessed day.